the battery under the driver's floorboard is for the for, engine. Yeah, for the engine. And there's a battery in the engine compartment that's running the lights? Yes, that's going to have your the all of the 12 volt stuff that the ambulance manufacturer put in here, which is your that so, vent, back and pump, dome lights. Right, so all we're concerned about is the dome lights. Right. Now, do I have to put that switch on the driver's seat on to, to use them? Yes. Up front, on your center console, there's a red button, which is your master power. Right. And then at the far right-hand side on the bottom row is going to be your module power. And if your module power's off, the dome lights are not going to come on. None of the 12-volt stuff comes on. Okay. So you make sure your master power's on and the module power's on, and then you get... All right, can we go up front and can you show me yes, what you're talking sure about right can. now and tie it in with this? Yep, I sure can. So up here, and see if you can see this. This is your this is your master power right, right okay, here. Okay. And then this is your module power. Okay. And so if your module power is off, then it doesn't supply 12 volts on the inside. Okay. When your module power is on, now you have your dome lights and you have all the other stuff that right. they have wired in here. Right. And the switches the over switch there next down to the there, seat, when right? When you disconnect that, it disconnects that battery under the hood. So that need so that's that, needs that to be switch on. over here needs to be on, and this needs to be flipped, and this needs to be yep, flipped. That's okay, it. and that's running the lights. Yes. That, don't talk about the other stuff because I don't care about okay. it. I'm not doing any suctioning in it, suctioning right. on a patient. Right. Okay. So switch next to the seat, the red switch, and that switch right there, and then we're gonna have lights. Yes. Now, but that's running off the battery in the engine compartment. That's correct. Now, that's if I'm not r running this, it's not gonna be charging. Um, with nothing's your, charging if that, you're driving, unless I'm driving, unless you're driving, nothing will be charging. But when you're, we have that set up to where if you're driving, the, the, what you're doing is the alternator is charging either is charging the one under there, your engine battery. Yeah. It's charging that one in the hood compartment. Okay. And it also when the, if those batteries out there, that isolator will say, "Hey, my house batteries need charge," and it'll send power over there while you're driving. So when you're driving, it'll charge. All it'll charge okay. all three battery banks okay. when you're charging. Okay. Well, I mean, when you're driving down the road. Okay. When okay. you're plugged in, you're going to be charging your house batteries. Okay. And that's it. At some point in time in the future, and the, I don't know why they didn't, but it probably would be decent and worthwhile to look into an auxiliary start oh to bridge to them. bridge the two, the the battery banks that's probably something fairly simple it would take a little doing but i think it'd be fairly simple and fairly inexpensive and it would just be a momentary um um switch switch with a relay that would just bridge the start battery with the house batteries because the house batteries have the solar panel charging them the alternator charging them and when you plug in the converter can charge them as well okay so they're all covered on the charge side okay um so if i if i leave that switch next to the seat on and these on mm -hmm. how long can i do that without running the rig do you think before. Would you want to turn them off if you're not going to use the lights, basically, just so it doesn't draw? Yeah, anything? I would think so. Just in case. Yes, I would. Okay. Since I we're would not think so. Sure yes. What's tied into that? Yes. Yeah. So, but I would. it's not. But my my starter from my engine's not going to die, though. Correct. Not, if I do. Correct. Run that down. Right. Okay. 